Larry Marshall knew Timothy Hill, one of the latest child victims. Marshall lived a stone's throw from the Omni, where some of the child victims used to hang out. According to Marshall's old roommate, when Larry was a security guard for Wagon Hut, he worked at the Salvation Army warehouse, and he took Timothy Hill and other children there and gave them toys. Marshall reportedly saw Hill the week the boy disappeared. Tom Terrell saw Timothy, too. Well, he was here on 12th because he was supposed to come back on the, on the 13th, and that was my birthday. But, but he, he didn't, didn't come he back. Didn't, he ain't been back here. Yeah, if he did, I didn't see him. Timothy was found in the Chattahoochee River March 30th. Marshall's friends say he left Atlanta on the 10th of March, so they don't think he's involved in Tim's death. But he may know something about it, because Marshall and Terrell say they are gay. That adds more fuel to the fire that some of the child killings could be tied to a homosexual ring. The FBI is investigating a Northwest Atlanta house that reportedly was used as a gay rendezvous, and some of the child victims, including Hill, were seen at the house. Atlanta police say they are not looking at the house, and they'll wait until Larry Marshall has returned to Atlanta to question him about the cases. DeKalb did not wait. They questioned Marshall in Connecticut.